We all know he can act, but can Johnny Depp sing? Well, we're about to find out in his latest big screen outing, Sweeney Todd. The dark thriller about the demon barber of Fleet Street is the sixth time the film heartthrob has teamed up with director Tim Burton. Of course, it meant brushing up on his cockney rhyming slang. These are desperate times. Desperate measures are called for. A small sacrifice to pay to work again with an old mate. There was a lot that appealed to me. First, first and foremost, that it was a Tim Burton film. Um, the opportunity to get back in the ring with Tim. Second, that it was uh, Stephen Sondheim's brilliant uh, 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 masterpiece. Um, third, you know, there was the possibility that, you know, it might work, it might not work in terms of me as, a, as a, you know, singing the part. So. It also features Mr. Burton's other muse, Helena Bonham Carter, who plays Todd's accomplice, Mrs. Lovett. Alan Rickman stars as Judge Turpin, and no, your eyes aren't deceiving you. That is Borat, a.k.a. Sasha Baron Cohen, looking a shadow of his former self. And with a stellar lineup like this, the gamble for the filmmaker all rested on his leading man's voice. You know, I didn't know if Johnny could sing or not, but he said he thought he could, and uh, that was good enough for me. And then, uh, you know, he sent me some music, and it was beautiful. And uh, so, I was, you know, it was interesting to work with actors who aren't singers. Uh, and a very difficult musical, so I think they all did a really uh, beautiful job. And while those Yanks get to feast their eyes and ears on Johnny and the gang, sadly we'll have to wait until after Christmas in the UK, as it's not out here until January 25th.